Hello everyone, Mrs. Lamont here. I am here to talk about one of my favorite things, Scrabble. As you all know, I love to play Scrabble. And now that I've been home, I can't always find someone to play with me. So I've been playing a lot of solo Scrabble. I've been playing Scrabble by myself and I wanna show you how. It's really fun. Uh, so basically you might have, like I have here, a bunch of tiles from my Scrabble game. You might have a Scrabble game at home, in which case you have the tiles. You do not need the board for this, just the tiles. And if you don't have a Scrabble game, no worries, because it's very fun to make your own Scrabble tiles just out of paper. So I did that here just to show you. I made these just out of kind of a kind of a thick kind of cardstock paper, but you could use construction paper, you could use plain paper, you could use sticky notes, you could use scraps, and you could decorate your tiles even if you wanted to. I made mine very simple. And I'm going to show you here. This was from my Scrabble game. This is the number of letters for each tile. So as you can see, there are nine A's, there are two B's, and so on. I left this here, so if you need to look this up again, you can, or you could just make as many as you want. That's fine too. So what I like to do when I'm playing solo Scrabble, I've started here, is I like to kind of think of a theme, and that's my first word. So my first word is spring, and my theme for all my words is going to be spring. And in solo Scrabble, I use all the letters. I don't just pick seven, I don't keep score, I just take the letters and I have fun with them. So now I'm going to try to think of another word that I could make that makes me think of spring. And as you know from Scrabble, it has to connect to these letters. So I think I'm going to write the word. Oh, you know what? I have a better one. I was thinking of rain, but I think I'm going to do robin because I love robins and they really make me think of spring. Wow. Okay. So now I have two words. Then I might do rain after that. So I see right here, I have some letters. So I'm R A I N. I could do rain. And I just keep going like that. And you'd be amazed how many words you can make. Like right now I'm thinking, hmm, what starts with R? What ends in G? Oh my gosh. S is amazing because you can always have a, a word and then make it a plural word and add an S. So you could add many, many other words that make you think of spring. But you can also pick your own theme. Maybe it's things in your house or maybe it's um, some activity you like to do or maybe it's, you know, something like a forest or trees, anything. Um, just have fun with it. And remember, Scrabble can be made however you want it and it does not have to be played with anyone else and you don't need to keep score. And I hope you have fun. Enjoy your Scrabble. I'll be thinking of you as I continue my springtime Scrabble. Bye.